Nate, Nate Bandit's, Bandit's, coming Bandit's coming back at you. Woo! Wow, this guy, I tell you what. All right, guys. We're back. We're we back. are back, guys. It's been you too know, long. It's been a minute, and finally, we got some lunch break here, and uh, Dustin was eating on his break. He was ah, going right to town, <laughs> eating it right off, weren't you, pal? <laughs> nope. Enjoying it. He likes tuna fish, and he would just like stuff it right in his face. Oh. Fun fact, I did not bring lunch today. Were you eating something else? Absolutely you not. You pie today, Dustin? No. No. No, 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 no pie this morning? <laughs> I'm all set with that. Flavorful steamed pie, like a steamed <laughs> clam. Oh, that's <laughs> so gross. <laughs> so gross. What? <laughs> Dustin likes a steamed clam pie, but well, it's nice and warm. Well, Absolutely you know, not. A little bit of seawater on it, so it gets the flavor too. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just gonna try to share a little bit here. Oh, he'll share. <laughs> he'll, share <laughs> he'll share his pie with people, won't you, Dustin? <laughs> a clam pie. Oh shoot, that's gross. What's the matter, bud? So gross. Was it good? Was it as good as you were hoping it would be? No, no, no. no. Not as delicious as you were thinking it was. Absolutely not. So yeah. So, <laughs> what are you guys doing? It's been a while. Doing? We uh, we haven't had a chance to get together. It's we've been wanting to go live. Just just haven't had that chance. Yeah, I've been busy. I've been busy working, and he's been busy eating steamed warm clam pie. Gross. <laughs> With a sea salt glaze, so salty. Anywho, that's disgusting. My stomach is in knots, guys. It's it's gross. It's horrible. Why? Why your stomach and us? It doesn't matter. <laughs> so, question for you guys out there: How many, how many of you guys we got going on right now? How many we got? All right, it's an off question. Has anyone ever had like anything get into their seat of their car, <laughs> <laughs> and like you can't get it clean no matter how much? Like if it's a cloth seat, you're just pushing it down deeper and deeper. Doesn't that isn't that horrible? Does that happen to anybody? Because sometimes it happens to people. And it might be like a feces. Easy on the Patriots. They're, they're horrible this year. I get it. But it's just one year. No, it's been four years since Bob Brady retired. <laughs> it's been four. The Patriots. One of these suck. days, they're going to win. Why don't you wear the Patriots? My Patriots. What, what's your Patriots sweatshirt you used to wear? Uh, it's ripped. It's ripped. Yo, I, I wear my <laughs> socks cap. Yeah, they suck. Guess what? I represent, baby. That's what I do all day, every day. <laughs> I'm a Sox fan. Yeah, this Pats fan here, he's, I ain't gonna wear, I ain't gonna wear that because they losers. I'm wearing my hat. Come on. You gotta cover it up with your sunglasses, hoping someone didn't see it. Old Eagle Eyes <laughs> out there noticed. Hey, Joe, how you doing? <laughs> All right, Joe. So, Joe, have you ever got anything on the seat of your car, on the cloth seat, and it gets stuck down in, and as you scrub it, it just gets deeper and deeper, you can't get, the, get it out? Because Dustin here, he needs a clue on his own personal vehicle. He's shit in it, and he can't, <laughs> he can't get the shit smell out. He don't know how. So can you anyone got, got, anyone got any clue on how Dustin gets the shit and the piss out of his seat? Sorry, oh, feces and urine. I'm sorry. I'm talking like a sailor here. Yeah, you are. So Dustin, how do you get it out? I don't know. It's it's gross. I'll tell you what I did use. Big old used... clam pie. <laughs> And it wasn't my sh crap, just so you all know. <laughs> what? This Sorry, TikTok. You? Trying to be clean here. It wasn't me. It was somebody else, but it's it's gross. So I had to I'm use my friends. gloves. I had to use sanitizer. I sprayed that sanitizer on it, and I scrubbed it pretty damn good. So someone pooped in your seat? <sighs> Not mine, but my, yeah. The other side. Rumor has it Dustin licked it as well. <laughs> it's so gross. My stomach's already turning. Well, then you shouldn't have had that clam pie. Here? You shouldn't have had that big old warm <laughs> clam pie for lunch. Oh, man. It's gross. Uh, so, guys, this is... Uh, <laughs> it's been a minute, so we had to make sure you guys <laughs> know what's going on with Dustin. Absolutely Clam pie not. eating poop. <laughs> Two of my bearded bits. <laughs> Two of us. <laughs> Uh, and sure. since your main ghost turns a fish on YouTube, check us out, guys. Check it's us out. some of the best faked material you'll ever see. <laughs> it's not faked. What we put out there is true. Who would fake a ghost find? What kind of loser would do that? Let me, I'll, I'll give a name. Oh, really? I'll give a name. 
See, I'm not in the ghost community. He is, so this was a, this was a legit question. I will give a name of one guy that I know that fakes all of his stuff that he puts out. Oh, that's here. I know for facts because I have investigated his home. Okay. And there's nothing there that, with all the claims that he has. Okay. Definitely nothing there. So he is that. a liar. Total liar. Total fake. I'm not the only caught on here. So it's a fake. A fake ghost. Is he in Maine? He's in Maine. Okay, wow. I'm not going to give a town, but I will give a name. Okay. What's the, I, I, His I name is know. Kent. Kent. K-E-N-T. K-E-N-T. Kent. Kent. He is the biggest fraud in the paranormal community that I know. Does he have, like, uh, YouTube and TikTok and he stuff? He does. He has YouTube on it. He might have TikTok. But he's if a If he's fake. desperate, he might. Kent is a fake. He is. Well, uh, I, this was a legit question. I just... You know, as I give him a high time, as you guys know about ghost hunting, as I didn't realize. And he myself, had a... I don't associate, anyways. But um, there's been a rumor, or two, saying that uh, he had told people that me and my team back in 2017, 2016, 2017, something like that, okay. ran screaming out of his house, <laughs> screaming, screaming, really, out of his house. Because we were scared of what happened there. And all our equipment was all weird. Never seen us stuff and, before. And that, that never happened? Was. Because I'm sure if something like that happened, even if you didn't go run screaming, if your equipment went crazy, you would have definitely posted that because that would have been... Absolutely. Found that, something. Why would it run? The only thing it run from is spiders. <laughs> Literally, guys. I hate spiders. Or people pooping on the seat. That too. <laughs> <laughs> but no. Seriously, though. Why really, would you he fake said that? Stuff? He said that. Wow. Yeah. So is he a, ghost, a fellow ghost hunter in the community, or is he like a... He is a, he a, say a, a fraud. Like, okay, I'm just curious, because this is all news to me. Was, he wow. does. He he fakes all his stuff. He uh, In one of the clips he has, he he's he's facing like his window. Okay. He turns around, and he turns right back around towards that window, and there's this shadow of this person on the bed. Okay. Like he's gonna do like some type of favor for him or something. A weird sex thing with ghosts. Something, oh, yeah. yeah. Does that ever happen to you? No, no. unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> what well, one of Dustin's you know lifelong fantasies is to have. I don't know if you call it intercourse with a ghost. And it's, it's, be, it's not a lifelong fantasy, but that would be kind of neat. But not a <laughs> lifelong fantasy. Just said about 30 <laughs> seconds ago when I thought of it, he said, what? <laughs> sounds pretty damn cool. That sounds interesting. <laughs> yeah, so uh, I'm sure there's people out there that fantasize about but that. But guys, you got to check out my YouTube channel, Central Maine Ghost Hunters Official. Check out our videos. This guy doesn't believe, and he he's watched our videos. So I, I want you to check out the two man band advantage on YouTube and subscribe. <laughs> That's what you need to Go do. Go see us too, absolutely. Two man band advantage. Right down the river. Throw the bandage right down the river. <laughs> but I'm gonna give a shout out to Nomadic Static Michael Owens. He's the one who made all the videos for Central Bay Ghost Hunters. He is our editor on the team. Um, go watch our videos and check them yeah. out. They're awesome. I love to talk crap about this guy. We need to guy, get him. But it, it, the videos are good. Videos. I, I hate to give credit, but the, the videos do look good. They really do. That's enough of that. I don't want to be <laughs> sick of being nice. But check out Two Main Bearded Bandits on YouTube. Guys are trying to grow it. Um, we're going to go there more. We just made a video today. That's going to go straight to YouTube. Straight to YouTube. It's like a YouTube five or six, like a six minute, seven minute video. YouTube exclusive, guys. So, check it out. But yeah, so, anyway, anyone, any seat cleaning, you know, ideas for this guy? Because he's got feces, he's got <laughs> urine in his seat, he's got clam chowder in his seat. <laughs> Warm, steam, clam, <laughs> pie, fell right in his seat. And it's a personal vehicle, just so you guys know. I will tell you guys, big things are coming. <laughs> big things are coming, I can't huh? tell you what's going oh on, but you know, gosh. this can be fun. Yes, it's true. It's true. Dustin has finally signed up for Viagra. So the big thing might come this The wife's going to be happy. She's got, <laughs> she's got a smile for the first time in her lifetime. All right, guys. We can't talk about that, I don't think, on, on TikTok. It's, it's not true, but still. <laughs> hey, it is what it is. What else? But, guys, anyway. Come back up. We see, I've seen some comments. I just... What? People actually want to comment with you. Yeah. Give you some cleaning tips. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> it's like a thinking face and laughing laughing at us. It's fine. Well. I laugh at myself all the time. I laugh at him, too. <laughs> so, 
But seriously, any cleaning tips? Because he does need to get the seat clean. <laughs> it, it, it has got poop, and it's got pee, and it's got clam pie. Still can't believe you don't like the Patriots guys. Yeah, they suck. They, they, they have to have forever. Brady made the team. He left, and now they, they crap the bed. More than people <laughs> crapping your seats. Oh, speak of the wife. She, she, like a surprise face. She left a surprise face. Oh! Up she did. Well, well, that surprise face can turn into a big smile, right? Or a little smile. Oh, I'm no, not sure what. Probably a little smile. You know? <laughs> you know? Woo! <laughs> Thanks for the credit. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, shoot. Anyway, guys. Yeah. So... I just can't go with the fact, like I said, this poor guy's got poop and pee in his car, a clam pie, and he can't get it out. Clam and pie. he needs help getting it out. If you guys got any clues, I say just scrub it deeper and deeper in so it sits in deeper so when people sit in that seat, the smell don't wave up. You get the germs in your mouth as you, uh, you know, talk. So gross. I'm telling you, I love Lysol. <laughs> it won't kill everything. It won't, but it'll help with the smell. It might help with the smell, but you still got the, the, the germs kicking up in your <laughs> nose and your mouth. Every bite you take, every sip of a drink, every time you talk, mm. you're swallowing the, <laughs> the clam pie. Hey, if you're in Maine, guys, check out Parafest Maine in Vassarboro. Go check it out. It's going on tomorrow. Oh, is it? Really? I didn't it know. It is. I, I never heard about it. <laughs> I forgot all about the weekend. Imagine that. I forgot tomorrow's the 21st. It's all right. It's all good. It's all good. It's going to rain. You don't want to be outside in the rain because sugar will melt. <laughs> You're just going to float. <laughs> float it away. Uh, yep. So, yeah. I tried to throw my wife outside when it was pouring out. Yeah. I thought she'd melt, but I guess... Uh, on Wizard of Oz, when the, when the witch melts, it's just a mess. <laughs> it doesn't really happen? It doesn't really happen. You're going to drop a house on her and her toes will curl off. <laughs> That's probably myth too, guys. I mean... <laughs> let's, let's find out! <laughs> drop a house on one of your wives. You've had many of them. The dude's been married more times than freaking... Uh, I don't even know. You, a girl walks by and is like, oh, I married her. Hey, I'm going to marry her next. You want to see it, Mr. Cashin over here. And, oh, he's got some of the most funkiest women that want him. It's woo. Don't you, Dustin? I'm going to drink the fifth on that one, guys. Drink the fifth. <laughs> you need to drink about a half gallon. Yes. That's all I'm saying. You a for, half that one, for that one, you're talking about it. You're talking about that one? Yeah, about a half gallon and a I need back. to drink four half gallons. I need, I need a lot of it. Basically, Give you need, me a barrel. <laughs> you need alcohol poisoning. Yes. <laughs> Just to get by. And now she won't even talk to him now that he knows. And that's weird. Two main beard man is coming back at you. RJ Vibes, you're the man. What's up, RJ? If you miss out, RJ, Dustin's got poop in his seat. <laughs> poop in his car seat. Someone pooped in his seat. He won't say who. I'm pretty sure it's him. <laughs> Oh, you killed me. It's funny. I was trying to. <laughs> yeah, so uh, if you ain't cleaning tips to get poop, clam pie, or, or, or urine out of Dustin's seat, his personal vehicle, by the way, he needs help. <sighs> uh, I don't know who did it. It's It's been good for the most part. This happened a while ago. Every now and then he gets a whiff of feces up his nose. <laughs> Whenever, no, I don't. I take care gets, of that pretty good. Whenever he gets tired, he's told me, top secret, Dustin, if he gets tired, he'll walk out to his, out of his house, walk to his car, and <laughs> sniff the seat. Get it little, wakes me up. Get a little hit of that poop, and it wakes him right up. He's got like a poop fetish. That's, that's what I'm getting at, guys. He's got a poop fetish. Oh, that's so gross. People like the, the old Cleveland steam where you poop on the chest. Dustin, Dustin likes to be a poop on. But you know who, to, who taught me that? Said that would wake you up? RJ! RJ taught you that. Uh, he said he'll go sniff it. RJ, you're, wake a, you right you're up. a poop sniffer too. You guys are weird. Both of you. You're weirdos. The two poop sniffing bandits. <laughs> Come on, RJ. You got to comment again. I know Come you're still on. there. <laughs> no, because he's like, I don't want people to know that I'm a poop sniffer. That's a weird fetish. 
man. You guys roll around in it like a dog. <laughs> Someone put All right, guys, I'm kidding. RJ didn't do it. <laughs> it was secretly Brian over here. It wasn't me. I think it's disgusting. <laughs> That's I'm, what I'm he a, says. I'm appalled. I don't like me. I'm standing away from the guy because he was sniffs poop. Oh, boy. Yep. So, I wish you called us. <laughs> guys, we are going to be uh, <laughs> We're going to leave, guys. Bandits, bandits out. out. <laughs>